everybody, this is Andrea. Welcome to another episode of Face Up Stories. We will continue where we left off last week with Justine Dancer. Since then I removed the hair and sealed her face so that the paint can stick on. Because the weather where I live has been rainy lately, I use my special technique to dry the doll each time after it has been sealed. With Justine I used three basic pencils. A black, white and brown one. For more information about the exact brands, check my doll FAQ in the description box. You can see that I've already sketched one eye just so I experiment with shapes and sizes before I commit to it. When I'm happy I draw the other side and I try to keep it as symmetrical as possible. The eyebrows are also drawn with pencils for a change. I've only used pastels for the cheeks and lips. I want Justine's lips to be a light peachy color, and for that to happen I need to have a lighter colored base. This is where having an airbrush comes in handy. I sprayed some white gouache on the lips, and a bit above the eyes as eyeshadow. Then I grab a clean brush, dip it in water and reshape the sprayed areas. Next step is to redraw most of the details again. Patience is key, it might not look nice right now, but it will at the end. Every time I spray, I add another layer of white, black and brown pencils to intensify the colors. You might think that the pencils aren't working very well, but if you repeat the process 5 to 10 times, I swear that the colors will look strong and vibrant. Now let's turn these white lips into cute peachy color with some pastels. And to enhance her lip shape I add some brown shading on the upper corners. Details like this really help to bring dimension to a face up. Now let's work some more on the eyes. We need to add some more shading and draw the eyelashes. I think she looks cute, but before she is complete she needs some gloss and shimmer. quite pleased with her, what do you say? Ok, let's quickly put some clothes and a wig on her. Yeah, I think she wears bright colors so well, especially blues and pinks. I really hope that more Ever After High dolls will be released with similar facial sculpts. Because Justine needs a friend now, she can't stay lonely forever, can she? So this is it for today, if you liked this video give it a thumbs up, comment and share. And if this was your first time on my channel, I'd love to have you subscribed so you don't miss out on any future videos. Take care and I'll see you again next week. Bye!